video is to describe how to create a quote unquote chair finder right within your calendar. Uh, I'm logged in under uh, Janet's uh, calendar right now um, and we're going to use this as a model for creating uh, public and available events uh, for a calendar. So I'm going to start by putting in for all Thursdays that from 8 until 11 in the morning um, I am located at the upper school campus. Now, I don't want this to block out possibilities for me to participate in observations or conferences or other um, important meetings, so I'm going to edit uh, this event so that two things happen. The first is that it shows me as available, um, and the second thing is that it shows me as public. So anyone who looks at my calendar, or in this case Janet's calendar, will see this event um, on their calendar, but it will allow them to continue to use things like suggested times or find a time. So I'm going to go ahead and click save. And then um, I would want to go ahead and start marking off uh, uh, times that I'm actually at upper school but not available. So let's say from 8 to 9 a.m. I'm teaching block one. This is going to go ahead and continue to mark me as busy and privacy is default. Um, and so now, yes, I do have overlapping events, but for others, they'll be able to tell that I'm going to be at upper school uh, and that I might have a window of time between block one and block three. And so when uh, Janet tries to uh, schedule an appointment, um, she knows when she uses find a time and uh, the suggested time features of Google Calendar and schedule appointment. So I'll show you a model of what this looks like. I'm going to turn off Janet's calendar and we're going to use Christine Saunders as an example. If you look at Christine Saunders' calendar, um, we can see that she's marking that she's free and available and when she's located at Highcroft or at the Blake campus and she's marking some meetings as private and biz, uh, as private uh, and when she's not available or meetings in which uh, she's teaching uh, with Patty or she's teaching with Joanne uh, so that uh, she that Janet knows or other people know that where a chair is located on a particular campus and can schedule accordingly so uh, for example, in this case, if Janet was trying to schedule an upper school appointment with uh, Christine Saunders at upper school, she knows that the next available window may be uh, sometime around 11.15 a.m., depending on uh, how much time the meeting is going to take place. So if it's a 15-minute meeting, Janet may ask Christine to be able to uh, schedule it. So consider, uh, like Christine here, creating a chair finder calendar using free, uh, using public and set to as available.